right. Um, uh, thank you very much uh, for sparing a moment uh, for us to share uh, views in relation to uh, a very silly suggestion um, that is being reported in some sections of the media, suggesting that uh, a political novice uh, in the name of Mirambo uh, Aimbe, who is a Minister of Justice, uh, suggesting that the government is pondering on stripping the former head of state, Dr. Edgar Chagalungu, of his uh, benefits because of uh, um, a statement he issued at a time that members of parliament uh, went to give solidarity as a result of uh, a clear you know, sham investigation by DEC um, in their continued victimization, harassment, and abuse of the former first family. Of course, we know that there has been an agenda to try and uh, continue poking the former head of state, his family, uh, with the hope that they can uh, cower him into uh, submission to their agenda uh, of never wanting President Edgar Lungu uh, to continue, for example, being a consultant, uh, to continue, of course, holding uh, the position that he has been bestowed by the globe in view of how he handled the smooth transition of handing over power in 2021. The globe has continued to celebrate Zambia and celebrate President Edgar Chagalungu for being not only a statesman, but one that is accorded the credentials of being a Democrat. Because of those high credentials, Misaka and HLMA and the UPND have been trying to rubbish his name by force cooked up allegations against his family and sometimes suggestions that seem to actually be targeting his person. I want to address Mr. Aka Indechire as my elder brother. The members say Mwikara Patalala Mwina Patalalika Your continued poking of the former head of state only goes to undermine your capability to govern this country peacefully. These little boys that are excited being in offices as ministers and so on like Aimbe are actually being used by external forces to undermine your office. President Aka in the the Patriotic Front, and its members, and all those who are supporters of President Edgar Chagalungu, and supporters of um, uh, the opposition political parties, have nothing to lose. You are the one that is in office. You are the one that have a greater responsibility to be able um, to use a high standard in your judgment in dealing with the citizens, including the former head of state. To suggest that you can strip off the so-called benefits. First of all, there's nothing to write home about in terms of benefits, whether it is financially or otherwise. This country has not fully dignified the office of a former head of state in terms of benefits that you can talk about. So there's nothing there, really there to take away. The only thing I can advise is that, like they say, you cannot defend a lion that is caged. You can defend a lion that is caged. You can explain about a lion that is caged. But the moment you open the cage, the lion will be able to defend itself. I want to advise and request President Aka in the Ichirema to think through. We have continued to advise both publicly and privately that think before you act. Otherwise, you are going to bring this nation into chaos. President 
Eddie Gachagalungu has respected your presidency from the time he left the inauguration at Hero Stadium. He has constantly stayed at home. He has even minimized his movement to give you enough space for you to govern this country. You are the one who continues through your surrogates like Aimbe, who continue to go and poke him out of his house. We advise, stop that nonsense. Thank you very much and God bless.